Jackson Mayor Shokwe Antar Lumumba's new executive order requires anyone going out to public places to wear a face covering to help stop the spread of COVID-19. 16 WAPT's Ross Adams live at the Walmart in Jackson where that plan is meeting resistance. Ross. Yes, Scott, a lot of people tell us they didn't even know about the new rule. Others say they don't plan to follow the mayor's mask mandate. Don't leave home without it. A face covering or mask is now required for anyone in Jackson who goes out in public or into a store to shop. I think it should be mandatory. They shouldn't let them in the store without it. That's what I think. My mask is in the car. I have forgot to bring it out. And I forgot to get her one, too. I didn't know that. I thought it was optional. You thought it was optional? Yeah. No, it's a requirement. Oh, it's a requirement now? Oh, okay, okay, well, I'll make sure I have my mask on. The mayor's mask mandate took effect this weekend under Mayor Shokwe Antar Lumumba's Stay Safe Jackson executive order designed to minimize the spread of coronavirus. And I just want to go along with it, go along with it and make sure that I, I get my, I make sure I, I want to stay safe. Some customers at the Walmart on Highway 18, which recommends face coverings for anyone coming inside, said they don't plan to follow the mayor's order. I think it's all a bunch of baloney. <laughs> Why? <clears throat> I, I, don't, I don't even know. I just, I haven't worn one since I've had, since it's been. I don't know if I got it. I'm talking to you now. So I'm helping you and myself. Am I right or wrong? Why not be safe? Now, the mayor's office says Jackson police will be able to issue misdemeanor citations to anyone in public without a face covering. It's unclear whether, whether the city has the power to force private businesses to kick out customers who don't wear a mask. Live in South Jackson, Ross Adams, 16 WAPT News.